Hi everybody, I just wanted to do a quick video about how you can learn the keys, uh, key controls, the key bindings in Armour 3 and obviously sort of mouse controls as well because it is a little bit complicated to see that say the least and I found a really useful tool is this kind of paper printout that you can get that has got, that lists all the, all, all the controls on because obviously the, the common ones, you know, WASD for moving around is, is obvious, you know, and aiming down sight, right click, um, firing left click on your mouse. But there's so many other things <laughs> that you can do that this really helps. Now to bring that up, what you want to do is if you go to go to Google and do a search for Armour 3 key bindings, the first thing that pops up is that one there. And when you click on it, it'll then take you to this and you can print it out and then cut it up, um, print it out in colour, print it out in black and white, um, and then you've got this really useful tool. The other thing that is super useful as well is, and you can look at this while you're in the game as well, but this is sort of in, when you're actually playing, if you go to the pause menu, but you can also get it from here, if you click on the little um, student's hat, if you go to the field manual, you can look at everything, and it tells you how to, say, open doors, God, my screen's really dirty, isn't it? How to use GPS. Um, there we go. Here's one that I was looking at earlier. I was looking at for how to apply how to apply first aid kits. You know, you got to move the scroll wheel on the mouse and then click it in, all that sort of stuff. And I found these uh, very very useful. <laughs> and often I pa I pause the game and I look at them. So there we go. That's how I'm learning all the key bindings and all the keys and the mouse controls for Armour 3. I'm using a combination of the quick key list which has got infantry infantry controls there, group team commands there, vehicle controls there, <laughs> and then I use the field manual inside the game itself. So there you go, hopefully that's useful. Put your questions in the comments down below. Thank you very much and I will see you again soon.